Welcome back to our channel. Ukraine's ongoing conflict with Russia has entered a new phase with recent reports indicating heavy losses for Russian forces. In the past 24 hours in this report, we'll take you to the front lines of the war where Ukrainian forces are Today we will discuss the latest losses from the Russian side. Dozens of Russian artillery and tanks have become easy targets for Ukrainian missiles and drones. These continuous losses do not rule out the possibility that Russian troops will lose. The war against Ukrainian troops Russia lost more than 50 artillery systems in armored personnel vehicles in Ukraine in the past day, along with 17 tanks. According to Ukraine's military, as Kyiv stares down a new Russian summer offensive, without concrete promises of fresh U.S. military aid, Russian forces have lost a total of 7,074 tanks in more than 25 months of full-scale war. military on Sunday, according to Kyiv's tally, Moscow has also lost 13,451 armored personnel vehicles and 11,316 artillery systems since February 2022. Equipment losses in conflict conditions are notoriously opaque, and Western experts suggest Kyiv's and Moscow's reported losses are higher than the actual figures. Russia's defense ministry said on Saturday that Ukraine had lost a total of 15,699 tanks and other armor combat vehicles, as well as 8,692 field artillery guns and mortars. Ukrainian officials and Western analysts have said a lack of shells has restrained Ukraine's operations as Russian forces inch westward, Kyiv fighters. Russia's troops use against Ukrainian forces a new trunch of military, economic, and humanitarian aid for Ukraine. Worth around $60 billion has been bogged down in Congress for months by infighting causing deep concerns in Kyiv, 